Viewer discretion is advised. No, you don't. Here's all the units involved in the pursuit. Right there, will do. Oh. <laughs> oh, a person in a car just went flying. Oh my God. This guy, this guy right here. Look, you get that too. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Grand Theft Auto 5. My name is Jeff Aviano, and this is LSPDFR. I am doing a uh, pretty much a requested patrol I get a lot. Um, a certain vehicle, at least. What is this idiot doing? Okay, this guy is driving like a jackass. Well, they kind of all are, aren't they? <laughs> yes, I think so. But we're doing the Mustang GT. Um, this is the unmarked version. Well, it's not really unmarked. Uh, it's got the terrible plate readers. I've never been a fan of those things. Um, it's got a push bar on it, spotlight and all that. So we're not like, you know, undercover or anything like that. We're just an unmarked unit. Uh, we'll pull off up here and uh, we're going to shoot some radar and see if we can catch some speeders. I don't think we're going to in this area here because this guy is going slow as hell, but we'll pull up there right up here on this little road, uh, access road. You can usually catch some speeders. So we're going to do a patrol from Polito all the way down to the Chumash area, um, patrolling on US Route 1. So let's see what happens this evening. Hopefully all will go well. Whoa! We got a land stalker doing 74 miles per hour up here. We're going to catch up to him. Don't uh, pay attention to the cyan blip. I had LSPD far crash on me when I was trying to use the mimic control. And uh, I guess that's what that cyan blue is. I, I don't know why there's a car that's messed up. It's just stopped up here now. It's completely bugged out. It didn't clean up. But nonetheless, we're going to pull over this land stalker. I believe he's doing, what, 74? So 14 over the limit, but 60. Let's go ahead and light him up. Oh, hello. And uh, we're going to wait for a good spot to pull him over. I think it's going to be up here on the after this uh, blind hill. It's kind of dangerous right here to pull him over. Uh, going to be up here right down the hill. If, man, traffic is acting so stupid right here. All right, we'll light him up. See if they pull over. And that was a terrible spot. So we're going to try to move him ourselves. Follow me. This way, please. Okay, it's working now. Nope, a little bit further. Yep, off to the road. Off the road. Completely, please. There you go, a little straight. There we go. All right, so he's listening. He's no longer listening now. That's good. What we want. All right, we're going to be out with this dude. Let's see what's going on here. Light him up. Pursuit of armed suspects. Oh, we're good on this. Let's go ahead and run the plate on them. Let's see if anything just come back on them. 86 George Union Adam 043. Looks like it is occupied times one. Suspect's license plate. See if anything's come back on that plate. Evaded police. Lily Anderson. Mr. Anderson. Okay. Seems totes. Well, they do have a problem, so. Okay, we're going to uh, call for a backup code three unit in case thing I should I meant code two but what are you gonna do okay driver seems nervous no big deal how you doing tonight what is it you doing huh Kevlam, give me your ID you know how it goes all right Lily Anderson that is definitely her all right sit tight we'll be right back with you let's do it now and no the uh audio's not distinct that was just me sometimes I say things a little delayed that's just who I am Lily Oh, Anderson. All right. Valid and no 99, but the bench warrant. So she's been known to evade police, so we're just going to talk to her here. The reason I pulled you over is you were doing uh, 14 over the limit. Okay, I think that unit's going to leave, but maybe not. We'll find out. We'll just go ahead and cite her $100 for uh, speeding. I was going to ask her if she's been drinking, so... Uh, she said yes, so now we have to do a little bit more work. All right, well, that's okay. Let's go ahead and breathalyze her, see if she has been drinking. It's a simple question just to ask. Okay, and she's fine. Right. So we're not going to hassle her too much. Um, we're just going to exit questioning, and we're going to cite her $100 for speeding. I mean, she was doing 14 over the limit. It's kind of bad. In a 60-mile-an-hour zone, especially through there, you know, the traffic kind of backs up a bit, so we don't want uh, any more issues and maybe she'll learn to not, uh, well, she already did learn her lesson evading the police. She didn't win last time, and now she'll be on her way. 
And hopefully she'll keep it slowed down. Okay, we're getting reports of a possible burglary fleeing, resisting arrest, and looks like they're headed towards us. So we're going to take her off road a little bit here. It's not very good for this car, but we're going to black out and come over on this hill and see if they are still headed towards us, which it looks like they are. We're going to hide behind this bush. Possible burglary suspects fleeing. Here they come right now. I think they're in a motorcycle, it looks like. Indeed. That's what they're in. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and light up. I don't think they're going to slow down for us, I have a feeling. But a good thing we're in the Mustang GT, as we'll be able to easily keep up with a motorcycle. All right, we're good here. And he is taking off now. Yep, pretty good speed here. Let's go ahead and uh, let's let local state know. That we might, hopefully we'll get another uh, bike unit involved. Alright, yep. So we're in a pursuit now with this guy. He is, uh... Oh, he's all over the world now, getting really crazy and aggressive. That's okay, though. Ooh, watch out for that GMC. That's a Chevy van, the G20. Alright, here he is right here. Alright, dude. Here's the interior. It's, uh... Not very legit because I don't have a line in the vehicle's meta to change out the interior. And in the README, it didn't tell me which lines to change out. I, I did put the um, I put the handling line correct, but that was about it. All right, so this guy's headed towards Polito right now. Still want to let State know. Hopefully we can get another unit involved. A bike for a bike would be cool. Because I can't do too much if he's on a motorcycle. A, a fleeing burglary suspect usually can have um, a weapon of some sort. You never know, so he's kind of taking it easy right here, but he is not showing signs of slowing down at all for our officers at this time. Here comes another unit, and it's another Mustang, and he's going to run him over, isn't he? All right, well, yeah, rolling road block it. Yep, right here. Nope. Did you just run him over? Nope. You little shit. You little shit. All right. Ooh, there it is. All right, now we have a bike unit behind him. Oh, they are. They just shot him off the bike. Hey, he's on foot. He's running from us. All right. So now we are in a foot pursuit with this dude. I'm gonna get my uh, my taser ready. Don't shoot him unless we have to, guys. Come on. Let's let's think about this. Oh, he just got hit by that SUV there. I, I'm going ahead and uh, tasing him. He wasn't showing signs of slowing down at all. All right, he's just doing uh, the jitters here. All right. Is AI going to arrest him? I think they are. And they did. All right, down to the ground he goes. Yep, it's an AI arrest. So our work is done there. We don't know why he was fleeing other than a uh, possible burglary suspect. It didn't say if they had any other information, but we're going to get on his bike and move it. We're going to get it towed out of here and see if he had anything on the bike itself. I know we're in the road and they're turning their brights on us. All right, let's see here. Shift G that. Oh, you're going to get hit by a truck. <laughs> Oh, that was amazing. Nothing interest. That's okay. Let's just get this thing towed out of here before this gets into a big mess. All right. And we're back to our vehicle. I don't want to get on it because it'll crash more control five. So here comes the box truck to pick him up now. So it should work out. I think. Yep. There it goes. All right. Cool. We'll go ahead and open the road back up completely. Get out of vehicle manager. We don't need that open. And we will be code four. Okay, we are rolling code two right now towards a impaired driver call. We're going to try to catch up with them. Let's turn our siren on. Let this person know we're on its w our way. We're going to pass here on the shoulder over the blind hill. Man, I got to get used to this dominator handling. It is crazy different. All right, get over here. All right, they're up here. 
There's that vehicle still. Haunts us forever. All right, here's this vehicle right here. It's completely destroyed. It's a Crown Victoria. And he is tailgating the hell out of that vehicle. I mean, really bad. All right, let's pull him over right here. All the way to the side. You look drunk to me, the way you're driving. Let's have him all the way to the side of the road here. All the way to the side, just by the cars. There you go, a little further up. That'll work perfect for us. Okay. So, yeah, it's this uh, stand here, which is uh, Crown Vic. We're going to put the spotlight on them a little bit here. Let's run their plate. 68 David Sam X ray 334. And it, the vehicle's heavily damaged. We're just going to be straight with them and tell them that they've been reported Sam, drinking and driving. Three, Owner's three, disqualified. Four, no, 1099. So, Darius Johnson isn't even supposed to be driving. Okay. I missed that last time I forgot to check on that guy that died. Got to check and see whether or not he was uh, had that warrant on his name. All right. Inside appears clean. Driver seems nervous. That's always good. Make contact with them. What's the problem? What's the problem? Desk for his ID. Give lum. Give lum. Thank you very much. Sit tight. Be right back with you. Darius Johnson. That is Darius. He has a owner disqualified on his plate, so he's not supposed to be driving. Darius Johnson. No, turn that off. So annoying, all these things. <laughs> yep, he has a suspended license, too, so that's the same thing, essentially. So we do know that's true. All right, let's talk to this dude. His car is destroyed, too. All right, Darius, you know you're driving on a suspended license, bud. You been uh, drinking this evening? Yeah, stay hydrated. Makes sense. Have you done any illegal drugs? I've done drugs, but legal ones, though. We've heard that story before. Let's go ahead and uh, breathalyze him. All right, because we did no alcohol in their blood. Okay, well, that's okay. We're going to go ahead and uh, we're going to... Um, Place him under arrest for driving on a suspended and there's an and it was a and he's you know driving with a destroyed vehicle so he can't do that anyway so suspended's a bad thing bro well actually you know what i'm gonna cut him a break i'm gonna tow his vehicle i'm gonna keep him on the side of the road here and uh if his car is clean and everything's fine we're just gonna give him a warning on the suspended license tonight are you looking for a beat down looking for a beat down get out of the car all right, I'm just gonna detain you, sir. Whoa. Yep, go and spin around. You're not under arrest right now. You're just detained. You're driving on a suspended. Kind of a bad You're thing. But we want to be nice to him. Give him the benefit of the doubt, you know. So we're going for the arrest here. I'm gonna move him off the road. I don't want another repeat of what happened earlier. So we're not even gonna call for a backup unit for that reason. Put your gun away, bro. It's not a big deal. Follow me over here. Darius, can you come over here or no? No, can't do it? What are you doing, man? Accident time. No, not that. You degenerate fuck! What, fuck. what are you doing? No, you're gonna get hit by a truck. Stop. Sick Follow me this way. Balls. I thought he was taking off running on me, but he he's finally following me. Alrighty. Yeah, right here's gonna be safe for you, okay? We're gonna search your vehicle. So sit down right there and just sit tight. All right, cool. All right, let's uh, see what he has in his vehicle, shall we? No, put that away, bro. All right, let's go ahead and uh, search this side first. I forgot to turn my spotlight on the car. That's okay, yeah, a lot of damage there on that vehicle. But he's just going to have to call a taxi or Uber or something. You know. Depending on what we find in his car. You never know. Let's check this. <laughs> yep, check that door really good. See if he threw anything. Nope, it's all good. Let's check the engine. Because it's pretty destroyed and I don't know what to think. I don't know what the... Th oh, man. Yeah, he... 
Got an overheating engine. Been driving it pretty hot. Nothing of interest. Okay, well, everything cleared out for him on that. We're just going to call for a tow truck to come pick his vehicle up. Um, because he can't drive it. Has no lights, working lights in the back end completely. Somebody's going to rear-end him at this time of day. But we're going to be nice and we're going to let him go on a, uh, you know, on a, a warning. Mainly because he's already got bad enough night as it is. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Put that away like that. You know, it's bad enough as it is that he... Okay. Yeah, he's losing his car and everything. So, no, stand up. All right. Can we hit six to let him go? I think we can. Nope. Maybe not. Can we? It's not looking like it. All right. Can we stand him up? Okay. Attention all there we units. go. 10, 15, suspect in custody. Suspect Clear is in custody. Four. No further units required. All right. Six. Let him go. Is that not going to work? Or can we not get in the vehicle? I'm not. Yeah, I know. But maybe we have to be in the vehicle to let him go. Let's try that. No. Can't let him go in this vehicle. Uh, I have an idea. What we can do is. Okay. Well. We're going to ask for another unit to come by so we can uh, use their vehicle and we'll uh, see if we can let this guy go. Okay, so a unit came by and lent us his car. We're going to see if we'll be able to let him go off of this. Great Ocean Highway. And we did. All right, cool. So Darius is good. Um, He just had to suspend a license. He didn't have a warrant or anything, so not the end of the world. You know, we're out here to better people's lives, not make them worse. Okay, we're responding to a pursuit in progress. Looks like they're headed right here towards us. There's a one unit with that vehicle. And it's a motorbike. It's night of the motorbikes, I tell you what. Okay, this guy is kind of stuck. Talk about times two. Or it's two of them. Oh, wow. He got right through them, didn't he? Yeah, he did. That didn't take very much. All right, so let's go. We're the primary unit right now. Heading north on US Route 1. We need to let state know what's happening here. Hopefully they can get involved in the pursuit. Here they come right here. Another one. Oh, yeah. Come on. Let's block them off right here. Oh, and he took the other way. All right. We're going to be the primary unit right now. And it's, yeah, I could buy times two on a bike. Let's move off the road so that we don't get clobbered by that car. It's another one of our uh, undercover units in the highway patrol. Wow, he's getting really squirrely up there. He could he's probably going to kill those people. <laughs> probably going to kill him. All right. We really need to get that bike unit up here so this guy doesn't run him over, which he's going to do right here. Yeah, you can't pit bikes. Well, he's learning the other way, I guess. All right, here is our bike unit in another... Oh, we have an LA uh, LSPD unit out of... Uh, Los Santos involved in the pursuit. Oh, let the uh, sheriff's department know what's going on here. And that we need backup on this call. Oh, they're trying to box them off up here. We're going to try to get in front of them a little bit and try to put some strips down on them. They are fast, though, aren't they? Yes, they are. But we're fast, too. But we want to get... All the way up here to where Highway 68 is and try to get him over this hill. All right, let's do it right here. Come on, get out. Out, out, out. Come on, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Put him down. Got him. Got him, got him. Beautiful job. We pulled the strips. They're disabled. They're going to be out of options here very, very shortly. They're headed towards uh, Zancudo right now. All right, we're going to just kind of sit right here and wait for the takedown since we are the primary unit. Um, they're just riding on the rims. Got a couple of rim riders right here. All right, we're going to try getting... We're going to stop the rim riders. All right, sound good? Let's get really slow here. Wow. This is exactly where we had our prison break suspect stop. We're going to go sideways on our vehicle. 
right here. All right, you guys done with the joyride? Off, off of it, off of it. Come on, get your gun out. Off, off the bike. You can get off the bike. You off the bike, one of you. Don't do something stupid. Dude, are you really gonna run from us? No. Ah, oh, shit. All right, they, they tased him. He's down. <laughs> Face first into the concrete. Face first. Amazing. Oh, shit. All right. That's an AI rest for him, which is fine. We can't hold anybody in the back of ours anyway. And then we got the other guy too. So let's see if they had anything on this bike. Just a bunch of morons running from police on a bike like this, not wearing helmets. And there were two of them. We'll check this side and we'll check the other side. If not, we'll just go ahead and tow it. And call it a night. That's pretty much all we can do in this situation. But that was a great um, use of uh, the spike strips. All right, I'm going to move my vehicle. We're, what we're going to do is really slow down traffic here. We're going to move my vehicle out of the way. We should have a unit on the way to pick him up. And I think they're on scene right down here, it looks like. Right here. Okay, this guy. And let's get this thing out of here. We're going to call for a tow truck. It'll be a box truck to pick this thing up. And it'll go down to the uh, good old impound lot. Just wait. And I think it's on its way. YRC. Yep, here he comes now. Attention all units. We have well, a criminal resistance. I think he's arrest. below us now. So... That's probably not going to happen. So there you have it. That's going to do it for this episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed. I had a good time, as always. It's always fun. This is a really cool car. Um, I just wish it that whenever you change the uh, components, um, it just deletes the interior and it takes the uh, plate readers away. But the, it deletes the interior. And then if you do that a couple times, it will crash your game because you'll have like a memory issue. That's what happened to me, at least. But, okay. Looks like that unit just came to pick him up yep there they are right there and they're gonna shoot everybody and it's all gonna go to hell so there we have it <laughs> perfect ending all right guys i'll see you on friday take care there it is